fact that, I don't know, Cloud is kind of relatable-ish. Cloud's just a... He, why, how why? is he relatable? Oh, <laughs> yeah, he is. How is he a bitch? So he's relatable to you. Right? But no, he's a, kind of a badass too, though, because he's got like this awesome power. It's just... Uh, it's emo power. Yeah, I, emo power. I gotta say, if I could be emo or have a machine gun arm, I'd, I'd have to go with the machine gun. I'd, I'm not power. gonna lie, though. I do love Cloud's bike. From the movie? Yes. Yeah. That is a pretty badass bike. I remember it being pretty cool, but I don't remember exactly what it looked like. It has a name, I forget its name. God damn it. A motorcycle. There, I found it out. <laughs> and if I had to choose number two, I'd choose um, Reno from that movie. Yes. I, I don't know why, but it's just like this random dude with red hair is like, yo. And instead I'm like, hey, it's that guy. I, I wish I had a better argument for it, but that, that's pretty much it. I just like seeing him, so. Right? That's my argument. I watched that movie even though I never beat the game. Dude, that movie is awesome. I own that movie. Mm -hmm. I absolutely love it. Alright, guys. It's you. Your opponent. Um. Uh, yeah, I guess it is my turn, isn't it? Well, actually, Mr. J, did you go? Yeah, he did. I oh, did yeah, go. Right. That's right. I got team killed. Everybody went. Alright. Well, I gotta say, my favorite character is probably. Not Sid. Um, Cecil. Yeah, I'll give you Cecil. Yeah. Cecil's, Cecil's awesome. Cecil's my favorite. I guess that's kind of unfair because of the fact that I've really only played through and beaten one of the Final Fantasies, and that well, was you've, four. You've, <laughs> out of all of the Final Fantasies, we talked about probably the two best. Three or four, so... Right. That's going to get you a lot of flack among the seven fans. Oh, I don't care about <laughs> the seven fans at all. The seven fans are pussies. It's because they identify with the fire. <laughs> it's because, it's because of the, they were too young to enjoy 3 and 4. That is true. Even the remakes were a little... I think I have to go with 10 being my favorite. 10? 10. 10? 10. 10. I, like, like, 10 was I like think one. 10 was really one that got them going again after uh, 7. I not they, they kind of went away a little bit. Yeah. No, not, not very much emphasis was put on 8. Yeah, eight, 8 or 9 were anything special. And then 10 kind of brought them back. And then, uh... To be honest, probably one of my favorite characters, though, from Final... I mean, this is going to go outside of the ones from, uh... Uh, that most people know, but I'm going to go to the Tactics one. And the guy named Sid. You're gonna have to be <laughs> more specific. Sid, he's basically a. Uh, um, Which one of the 15,000 Sids are we talking about? Is he a mechanic? Cause no, he's not about... even a mechanic. He's from Tactics, where. Uh, I mean, Tactics, they have their own little special little classes and all that. And he was a, he uh, was human, but he uh, had the abilities of the. Um, Oh shit, what were they called? The um, Crazy Dragon Dudes? Yeah, the Lizard Dudes. I don't like to be called Lizards. And uh, I believe they're called Amphibians. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, he was, had those powers, and he's, he just was awesome. See, the only problem with the Alex is he's not like the other Sid where he can actually build flying ships. Which one of the other Sids are we referring to? <laughs> uh, the one from 4, the one you've played? True. That was a good Sid. Yeah, that's <laughs> the best Sid. <laughs> There's been a Sid in every single one of them. Uh, all right. Fair enough, fair enough. Here's a topic that I think we can all get behind. Who's your favorite Pokemon? Oh, God. Because <laughs> I heard that you like Mudkips. Can we, uh, can yeah, we, me? Discuss, can <laughs> we do, awesome can we keep it out of, like, the realms of, like, Generation, like, 5? All of them. Doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't matter which because one. Who's your favorite? Because the only one that I, the only ones I'm gonna be able to get you through is like Gen two. It's that's fine. That's fine. Then you I mean, those are your favorite. Then pick from there. Because I already know. That doesn't my mean favorite. we can't not have a favorite from a further generation forward. Mm. All right, Mr. J, you wanna go start us off? Yeah, I gotta go with Blastoise. He's a turtle with giant ass cannons oh, on I his back. Like that. That's all you need from a Pokemon. <laughs> Good answer. Solid choice. Blastoise was awesome. I like it. All right, Nord. Come back to me. I'm still thinking. This is a hard choice. There's 600 of them plus. Almost 700. It is a top fucking choice. Good foul kill. Thank Good foul kill. Good 
the pony toss. There you go. All right, pony toss. Oh, we actually got some, some something out of the silent protagonist. Silence, silent protagonist so has what, picked what, pony what toss. Press, Gray Fox. It's me sipping on a nice ice cold Mr. Pip. <laughs> <laughs> Um, my favorite Pokemon? That's a tough one. Oh, uh, it's very f it tough. Is, it is a hard one. That's why I picked it, because it's something we can fight about. Uh, I gotta say, my favorite Amibu again? Um, my favorite Pokemon probably has to be... It's a tie, actually. It's a tie. Yeah, I have a tie between, uh, Sandshrew, because I love Sandshrew, good choice, good and Cubone. My two favorites. You like, you like grab Pokemon. Yeah. It doesn't even matter what type, I just think they look awesome. No, that guy just straight <laughs> up had a bone. It just... He wore a skull. Yeah, like, like he that. took a... Like, that's he real. took, like, a dead Tauros. He took the head of it, put it on his head, and then he took the bone from, like, the leg and just beat people with it. Like... And, like, when he found a bigger Tauros to kill and use the bones of, he called himself Marowak. He didn't even look different. He just had a bigger skull. Marowak sounds like marijuana, too. I guess that's probably another reason why, right? Indeed. He liked to whack things with his bone marrow. Oh. I want to. I want to. I want to whack things with bone marrow. Alright. Alright. I like Kabutops. He's my favorite. Good answer. Good answer. Oh, I like Kabutops too. Kabutops is pretty badass. Yeah. Maybe that's all the choice to all the Did, uh, but here's the question. Did anybody like Amistar? <laughs> there are people that are out there that do. Because <laughs> I've never met one. I, all I know is that every time Sunny picks the uh, the one fossil that gives you Amistar, the only thing you hear after that is, oh, fuck, I picked the wrong one. <laughs> I'm gonna go start my game over. I man. wanted Kabuto. God damn it. Oh, wow, we're getting killed. Oh, wait. Pick it up. Pick it up, tables. Sword, give us your answer. All right, we need an answer. <sighs> Because we already all picked. <laughs> I mean, I know what every <laughs> single Pokemon from like every single generation. So do I, but I think I do want to give a shout out to Hitmonlee. Yes. Just because yes. once good he choice, do, he choice. kicks people. He just kicks people. And he place. jumps and kicks people. That, that's he is the Chuck Norris of Pokemon. Fucking shit. Like, oh, you got fire? Oh, I could just jump and kick you in the face. Roundhouse kick. Well, I'm, Roundhouse I'm, kick. Gonna give, I'm actually going to give a sh shout out to Magikarp because he evolves into Gyarados. Yeah, yeah. That is sweet. I recently saw a so comic that had a... To level. I recently saw a comic that was called Pokemon Real Life. Uh, there's, there's been a couple of those, but this one's pretty interesting. It had a, <laughs> it had a guy with a Magikarp. And he walked up to Pokemon, grabbed his magic card by the tail, and beat them to death. And then eventually his magic card changed into a Gyarados. And it was called the real way to get Gyarados. <laughs> I, thought, I was just thinking to myself, that is exactly what you'd have to do. In real life, you would just have to pick up your magic card and just beat things with it. <laughs> eventually it would be like, okay, okay, I'll change. <laughs> change my ways. Oh, man. All right. Come on, Nord. Nord. God, guess again. Give me a second. We've given you a round. I know. Shut up. <laughs> Gosh. Jesus. And we're back to. Bay. All right. So I like almost. I love all the water starters. I have to give a shout out to every single one of them because I've always started off Pip with. Piplo. Piplo and his evolved form. Um, it's pretty badass. Um. <sighs> To be honest, a really good one, I would have to go with Snorlax. Uh, I mean, Snorlax awesome. Mm -hmm. um, I also need to give a shout out to Alexam and uh, oh, Gengar. Those are really cool. Yeah, I use them every I mean, time I, I play. Exactly. Um, man. No scope well, like I want to give another shout out to Arcanine. We'll just give a shout out to all the Pokemon. <laughs> They're all good. <laughs> well, <laughs> That's why it's there, well, there's some that are meh. Nah. All right. Well, let's let's change the question up then. What's your least favorite Pokemon? Oh God. <laughs> See, that's that's. I think that's harder. Right? Which Pokemon do you absolutely? Zubat. 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 I can see that. I can see that. I think most people can agree with Zubat. Zubat. Rattata. Rattata. Because yeah. you just at the very beginning, that's, that's it's either Pidgeys or Rattata. If I had to throw my hat in that ring. I would say Metapod. <laughs> How many times do I need to send you out to do your death before you eventually turn into a butterfly? 
a beautiful butterfly. Why can't I just hang you on a chrysalis wall and watch you and just wait for a couple of days? I've got to say, Abra. Abra, yeah. Hey. Abra is such a pain in the ass, it's too bad he turns into, can turn into the one of the greatest I know. His ball forms are so cool, but before that, it's just like, oh, dude, it's an Abra, this is awesome. Throw Pokemon. Oh, no, he's gone. Oh. I'm disappointed again. In that respect, I'd have to go with Thundaris from the but, new but, generation. But, but when you came back with a Super Bowl or something better than that, and you finally caught him, did you not feel accomplished? I mean, I'm just going off the original frustration I felt, and I didn't feel that towards any other Pokemon in the uh, series, so that's where my um, thing goes. That or The other thing that makes it that makes him tough is that the fact that Casey moved back. you have to trade him yeah, I didn't like it into Alakazam. Yeah. Which was bullshit. It was hard enough to catch him. Well, that's how you know he's good. Oh, dude, the I game makes you go through so much effort just to get him. Oh, wow. We're not controlling any command posts yeah, at all. Yeah, dude. Can you get out and grab two? Oh, yeah. Never mind. You should defend me. Get back in there. I'm not in <laughs> That's there. what she said. I got it. You get out. If you're talking to Jeff. Or Jeff, who's player one. I'm player one. Okay, okay Jeff. Okay. I'll defend you. Get behind me. Oh. <laughs> Alrighty, our garrison bonus has Damn, activated. that sucked. I told you just to get behind me. You killed me! Player <laughs> <laughs> 3 killed player 1. If you didn't fucking shoot me, we wouldn't have a problem with you. Alright. Alright, so, so far we have Abra as one of the least favorite. And we have Rattata and Zubats. And I forget which one I picked. Oh yeah, Metapod. Metapod and Kakuna for the tie. Because it's really hard you to You know who I really team. didn't like? Togepi. Even though <laughs> Togepi's evolved form is... How do you not is, like Togepi? It's his evolved form is pretty epically badass. I would say... I mean, especially when Generation 4 came around with the, uh, the third evolution of Togepi. Let's we'll just throw this out there. Probably one of the best flying Pokemon in the game. I'll tell you one of the other ones that I didn't really care for, and that is Kiram. I didn't think Kiram was all that great. Uh, you know, to be honest with you guys, my least favorite are all the legendaries. I just didn't like Kiram because he was the hardest legendary to catch, and he really wasn't all that great for what you got. Nah. He was ice and flying, which is a good type mixture, but honestly, besides that, it was like, why did I just waste all this time? <laughs> I didn't even use my Master Ball. I still have a Master Ball in black and white version, but I have all the legendaries. Yeah. What do I do now? <laughs> I See, I never liked the legendaries in Pokemon because I thought the other Pokemon were so much better. Right. I mean, I like I always could go through the game. I'm like, I'm going to catch this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy, and have my party I, I, all I, I set a, out. I got a question here. Have you ever gone in to catch a legendary, and you throw out one of your Pokemon, it's equal level. Delicious. And then you use an attack, and then you accidentally one-hit the legendary. Oh, I've done that all the time. I've done, yeah. No. Does that just piss you Let off? me tell you an Not even really. worse feeling than that. When you're in the Safari Zone, oh, God. <laughs> and you finally catch a fucking Kangaskhan, and then your batteries die. <laughs> <laughs> because that happened to me once. <laughs> in the original generation. I was so pissed off. Oh, okay, hold on. <laughs> that hold on. Gone for a week. Favorite Pokemon? Dagobah, use... Scyther. Use the Jedi. Scizor. Evolve form of Scyther. By far my favorite Pokemon. Okay. I mean, he... Okay, I'm gonna just throw this out there. He's Steel and Bog, and his only weakness is Fire. I'm gonna give us a different topic now, because I like that last topic, but this topic's gonna be a little bit different. Who's your favorite Digimon? Yes! I was thinking that. <laughs> when you said... The, when I you remember the names. When you said that, I'm like... Yes, Sorry, where's Digimon? Digimon. Digimon, Digital Monster. Digimon, Digimon yeah, I the love champion. that show, but... <laughs> I know, I don't awesome show. Oh. To be honest with you, I thought one of the...